today we shall be talking on a very important issue related to learning that is the gaine view of learning gaine as an american psychologist has given the synthesis of learning and three aspects of gaine's view of learning is very important one is conditions of learning that is also known as eight types of learning then nine phases of learning and five variety of learning along with these three key concepts we shall be discussing the merits and limitations and educational implication of gaine's view of learning which is being considered as the synthesis of learning synthesis of different types of learning as we usually do firstly we shall be outlining the lecture so let us outline the lecture so as you can see gaine's view of learning so we shall be trying to understand about the gaine as a human being and also as a psychologist then as we have told eight types of learning it continues you can see different types of learning are in different slide so these are the eight types and one type of learning that is not the part of the gaines learning but it's also being considered as the very important type of learning that is principal learning we shall also discuss it then as i have told nine phases of learning you can see and then variety or category of learning that is five in number and then components of gaines theory for instruction now how far these theory of gaine views of gaine educational view of gaine is important for instruction and point of view so you can see the taxonomy you can see the types and also the events nine events and these are the gaines functions instructional functions for teachers and then the last part that is the educational implication and the limitation so this is the boundary of the lecture now we shall be discussing all these aspects which we have gone through in six parts firstly we shall be discussing on gaine as a psychologist so let us start the lecture from part 1 that is beginning so gaine as a psychologist uh, its full name of gaine is robert mills gaine and so far as the life span of gaine is concerned he came on the world rather he born on 21st august 1960 and he died on 28th april 2002 as we have already told that he was an american psychologist he became very popular in 1965 when he wrote then he wrote his book the conditions of learning in which he described the analysis of learning objectives and explain that how these different classes of objectives of learning are related to the appropriate instructional design so his milestone work is through his famous book that was published in 1965 that is the conditions of learning and that is why the gaine is being known as the propounder of the conditions of learning gaine learning view is being considered as the synthesis of learning he synthesizes through eight types of learning different types of learning 
and these different types of learning is being is extracted from the different learning theory as for example operant conditioning classical conditioning and like that which we shall discuss in other part so robert m gane combined behaviorists and cognitive hist approaches to discuss different types of learning in the name of conditions of learning just we have discussed about the famous book of gane that is conditions of learning what he did he tried to synthesize the behaviorist approach and the cognitive hist approach he synthesized the existing learning theories to develop a hierarchy model of different types of learning in his book the conditions of learning when we shall discuss the eight types of learning we will come to know that it is hierarchical in nature मतलब जो पहले स्थान पे सिग्नल लर्निंग रखा आगे हम लोग देखेंगे और फिर बाद में जो प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग रखा तो दिखाया कि ये ग्रेजुअली इजी टू डिफिकल्ट के की दृष्टि से ये बढ़ता चला जा रहा है इसी को कहा हेरारिकल इन नेचर मतलब ये जो सिग्नल लर्निंग है इट इज़ वेरी इजी टू अंडरस्टैंड वेरी ईजी टू लर्न और जब फिर प्रॉब्लम सॉल्विंग है तो दैट इज द मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट पार्ट ऑफ लर्निंग मोस्ट डिफिकल्ट टाइप्स ऑफ गैने प्रेजेंटेड एट टाइप्स ऑफ लर्निंग और कंडीशन ऑफ लर्निंग और वेराइटीज ऑफ लर्निंग इन विच हेरारकी इज फ्रॉम सिंपल टू कम्प्लेक्स एज वी हैव टोल्ड दैट गैने सिंथेसाइज एंड गैने सिंथेसिस ऑफ डिफरेंट टाइप्स ऑफ लर्निंग इज फ्रॉम सिंपल टू कम्प्लेक्स और यू कैन से इजी टू डिफिकल्ट हेरारकल इन नेचर इसीलिए कहा जाता है सो Gane was a brilliant psychologist. He worked. He given new set to the different types of learning. Now, in the next part, we shall be discussing about different types of learning. That is, we shall be discussing eight types of learning. Thank you very much.